Ladies and gentlemen, let's say hi to my buddy Giggy right here. Giggy, tram car driver. How many years you been driving a tram car? 32. 32 years driving a tram car. And my next special guest is somebody, you don't recognize her face. Uh, but I want you to close your eyes. Everybody close your eyes for a second. Hit it. Watch the tram car, please. Watch the, watch the tram car. Let's have a hand for Floss the tram car voice. Now tell us the story. How many years ago did you record that? 50. 50 years ago. And you were, tell us, because you had no idea what the heck I you were doing. In infant. Exactly. You were a little baby just learning to talk. So you worked in the office and they said, here, can you record this? No, I work, I work at the gas company at that time. Okay, and yeah. then what they ask you to do, just here, here's a piece of paper, say this? No, as a friend. Okay, and you said it once, twice, and it, did you just, ever imagine? No. Imagine if you got a penny for every time that darn thing played. Right. You wouldn't even be here, you'd be in Florida. <laughs> I just come here for appearances. There you go, let's have a hand for Floss, the voice of the tram car. All right, Gibby, hit it, come on, we're gonna have some fun today. We're going to open up the doors, the big grand opening, tick-tock, 10 o'clock, all right? So we got the countdown going. Gibby's here with the music. Hit it, buddy. There we go. Every time we hit her shoulder, she says it. Watch. Watch the tram car, please. Watch the tram car, please. Watch. 21st and 22nd, right across from the Seaport Pier. 10 o'clock, we're going to open up the doors. Wait till you see what's inside. Everything tram car. And King's daughter, Diane, is here. The second most famous tram car driver. The tram car store. We open it up at 10 o'clock. The big door will rise up. Wait till you see all the stuff inside. Gig is here. Floss, the voice of the tram car, is here. Gibby is here. Come on, come get your picture taken if you want. We're gigging with Floss. Welcome to it, everybody.
everybody. In just a minute, we're going to open up the big doors to the most anticipated store opening on the Wildwood Boardwalk in years. The tram car store. Tram car synonymous with Wildwood, right? Up and down the boardwalk. Before we cut the ribbon, though, I want to just say hi to a couple of different folks. Let's have a hand for Patrick the Mayor right here. Come on, come on. Good morning, everybody. Good luck to the Salib family. We're looking forward to the tram car store. All right. Laura's Fudge is here. Hi. Good luck to your store. Welcome to the Wildwood. All right. Now, hold on. Another guy that's here, you probably see him. He's driven the tram car for how many years? 32. 32 years. Let's have a hand for Geek, the most famous tram car driver. And another special guest. You know the voice, but you don't know the face. So I want you guys to close your eyes for a second. Everybody, close your eyes. No peeking. Close your eyes. Watch the tram car, please. Watch the tram car, please. Let's have a hand for Floss, the voice of the tram car. 50 years ago, she recorded that message, and if she only had a penny for every time they played it, it would be great. My man Lou over here from the tourism group. Good morning, Bob. Good luck, George. And hold on, who we got? Hold on, us we got here. Huh? And we could not have done it. Without the great folks from Sturdy Bank, everybody. Sturdy Savings Bank. Congratulations. The family, we're so happy for you. The Sturdy Savings Bank uh, made this all possible for George and his family. Uh, happy, come here, Bob. We got Bobby over here from the uh, Wildwood Hotel Motel Association. George and Nancy, good luck. You're my good friends. I'm really looking forward to this story. John Lynch. Oh, John Lynch is up top there. Come on, lunch with Lynch. There you go. All right, I think we're ready to go. We got anybody else? Lori from the chamber. Say, oh, Lori from Laura's Fudge, the chamber. All right, now put your chamber hat on. It is my chamber hat. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> know what I love about it? This is what's wild, what's all about it. It's one big happy family. Everybody here today helping each other, and we've all helped George and his family put this together. So, and you know, but the real boss behind it is your wife right here. If you were, what has it been like? George has been crazy putting this whole thing together. What's it been like living with him over these last couple the weeks? The truth is, I'm the crazy one. He's the one that's put it up with that. And have it a hand for their sons right here. All three guys are ready to go. All right, we're going to do a picture. Everybody get in here for a picture. And then we're going to do a countdown. All right, don't cut anything yet. Everybody in here. Come on, Patrick, get in here. All right, we got wait, gig. Wait, don't cut yet, don't cut yet. Not yet, not yet. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Lisa, you good? One of them should be good. All right, are we ready? Hold on. Are you ready? We're going to count with me from 10 backwards. You ready? Here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. Three, two, one, cut the ribbon! Yes! Let's open up the door. Ladies and gentlemen, the brand new store on the boardwalk, the tram car store. Come on in. Come on in, everybody. The tram car store is open. Oh, not quite one. The hottest new store on the boardwalk. We got the tram car plushies, the seagulls, the tram car hats, the tram car bags, the tram car coffee mugs, the tram car goosies, the tram car keychains, the tram car bags. The tram car backpacks, the tram car footballs, the tram car soccer balls. Everything tram car. The tram car split blocks, tram car slides, tram car underwear, tram car pajamas. Come on in, my wood. The tram car store is open. Oh, my God. 